Well, here's a new one. 60,000 bees have been stolen from the Carlisle headquarters of the giant company. There are many questions surrounding the how and why. Seth Kaplan reports. When you run a big supermarket chain, you deal with crime. So, you know, shrink, theft, organized crime, um, even occasionally violence. Like, these are not new things in the retail world. But never in Nicholas Bertram's years as president of Giant did he ever hear about an emergency quite like this one. I got a phone call from uh, from our VP of team experience in the middle of the night. The hives are stolen. Three beehives with 60,000 bees. This is where they used to live. This was their spot and uh, they're actually beautiful. Producing honey locally, part of a sustainability push at the company. Plus kids got to see them on school field trips until last week. I was wondering if it was a joke, but then I found out it actually wasn't and then a bit more research. Like everything, honey is more expensive these days, meaning honey bees are more valuable. So what do you do now? We're gonna replace the hives. Now look, sad as it is that the giant company is missing the little bees that used to be here, Giant will be fine. We all spend enough money in their stores, don't we? But there are other people who aren't fine when something like this happens to them. There are people right here in Pennsylvania that's a source of income, like that's how they take care of their families. So because whoever did this is probably doing this to other people, Giant is asking anyone who has any tips to please call Middlesex Township Police at 717-249-7191. You can see the road right here, so Harrisburg Pike. It's not like they were hidden, and we have signage that talks about what these are. Coming this spring, more security and more bees than ever. So we will have actually six uh, hives that will be coming in in the springtime. Meaning more than 100,000 honeybees. Unbe Never mind, you've heard that one before. In Cumberland County, Seth Kaplan, ABC 27 News.